Hello everybody. Um, thank you so much for everybody that has worked so hard to get Teams going and working this week. Teachers have really loved it. Um, a special thank you to all your grown-ups at home that I know have been really helping you with getting started. I hope you've been all enjoyed seeing each other as well as your teachers um, in school. So we've got a few new things that we're going to start doing this week with you and so I just want to show you what they are. The first thing you will notice when you log on in the next few days is that you've got two teams that you're part of. So you will keep with your class team that you always have been in but also you'll see that there's now a year group team. This is when we do things um, like worships and also our morning welcomes. We're now going to do with the whole year group there and two teachers um, talking to you and presenting about the work. But most things are still going to be in your class um, team or channel. So if I'm going to click on that, you can, I'm just going to unhide that one there so that you can see. The first thing that's going to be new and happening is we're going to start pasting the table that has our home learning in that's usually on our website. We're going to copy it so that it's in your channel for the week as well. So that means then you can just go into it. You can click on any of the links. So for example, I'm just going to click on that one there and you'll go straight to that lesson and get started on it. So every Friday afternoon, that's gonna be pasted up for the week ahead. And then each day, we're gonna give you um, the links to those lessons that you need to be doing that day. Obviously, you don't have to do the lessons that we're suggesting, um, but in the mornings, that's what the teachers are going to talk about in the morning welcome, um, about those lessons in particular. So it might be a really good um, thing for you to try and stick to our structure that we're suggesting for you. It will also make sure that during the week you get everything done. So there are two new things that we are starting. We're also starting to set you some work through assignments. So if you click into assignments and if you choose your class, a week on Friday, so Friday the 15th of June, we are going to set your extended writing English homework in there. So all you do is click to go in and I can see here um, that there's a set of instructions about what you need to do. Over here, um, there's some success criteria. So if you click on that, it actually tells you the things that your teachers are looking for in your writing, just like we would do normally when you're in school. So do have a look at that before you start writing because it'll be a massive help and you'll know what you need to include. So you can complete your work either say in a Word document um, or you could handwrite it and then just um, take a photograph of it. And basically, I'm just going to shuffle that down so I can minimize that screen. When you're ready, you just click on add work and you load it up just like I know lots of you have been doing um, with work that you've been sending in by email. So just attach it to the document and then when you're ready, you can turn it in to the teacher. So send it in. Now, one thing I did forget to tell you is whenever on team you see this little symbol here, it's something called immersive reader, which is really helpful because it reads Test English it out to you. Due June 12, 2020, 9 a.m. Instructions. Write a description of your favorite animal. So if there's something there that you're struggling to read a little bit, that immersive reader will always help you. So you've finished your work, you've checked your success criteria to make sure it's meeting it, you've attached it um, to the assignment, so then you're going to turn it in. Ah, oh, and I get a little picture to tell me I've turned it in. That will go straight to your teacher. They will mark it and give you some feedback and then it will come back to you and you'll be able to click on the, that assignment button and read their feedback. So just a reminder of our new things, we've got assignments being attached with the extended writing being the first one. We've got weekly work and then we've got our usual morning welcomes, small group check-ins, and our weekly class chats as well. So we look forward to seeing you on all of those things soon. Bye.